First Alert Forecast with meteorologist Patrick Evans. Jeff and I are looking forward to being on that inaugural flight on those boom jets. It's going to be a lot of fun. We are looking out at a time lapse photo from uh, Chris Tarpening from up in the high desert where significant rain fell yesterday. Joshua Tree picking up rain. Uh, Big Bear, there were flash flood warnings as a result of the rain. Skies slowly cleared in the evening hours. Now we're seeing the results of that rainfall. The rain that falls in the high desert has got to go somewhere and it filters down into the washes here and that's why Indian Canyon is closed this morning. That wash filling up a little bit with some rainwater and covering the roadway. You're looking out at Indian Wells and a fairly clear day. You can see both of the mountains today, which was not the case yesterday. Uh, still a little bit of humidity out there, not as much as yesterday and the cloud development's a little bit slower. We're going to see mostly sunny skies. It should be a pleasant day, but it was hot yesterday. We've got one to, to 110. Heat advisory up for a reason in the Inland Empire, and you can see it covers areas from San Bernardino all the way down to Temecula. We're not included in that, but our temperatures yesterday were above average, and today we're likely to be a degree or two above average as well. We're holding on to 88 in Palm Springs. It's 84 now in Cathedral City and Palm Desert and La Quinta. Slightly cooler at the east end of the valley, but also a little more humid. Dew points running in the low 50s this morning. Right now in Palm Springs, our dew points at 51. The relative humidity at 28 percent. So evaporative coolers should work pretty well right now. We might see those dew points change as we go into the afternoon. Uh, they should be at their highest right now because we're close to our morning low. But you can see they're pretty thick. As you work your way across the East Valley, those numbers up close to 70. So as we move through the day, we're looking at modestly lower dew points today and also tomorrow. But then on Friday, we start to pick up increasing dew points. And look at this. Friday at 6 a.m., we're looking at dew points in the mid and upper 70s. Well, what does that mean? How does that translate to how you can use that information? Well, that means the chance of thunderstorms increases pretty significantly when we see dew points that high. So that uh, it means I think for us, we're looking at a pretty good opportunity for thunderstorms Friday, Saturday and Sunday, not just in the mountains, but here on the Valley Floor. First alert comfort air 70 forecast up close to 110 again today and tomorrow, increasing humidity and an increasing chance of storms into the weekend. We'll be right back after this. Stay tuned. You're watching News Channel 3, the desert's news leader.